So who was the cop that killed that Nashville shooter? Well, let's check it out. Here, a Nashville officer who stopped school shooter is from Chicago. Wow, okay. And I guess everybody's flags are half staff. No, rightfully so. One of the officers credited with stopping the shooter inside a Nashville, Tennessee elementary school on Monday grew up in Chicago. And his family said they aren't surprised by his bravery. Let's check this out. Absolutely wonderful stuff. We're also learning more today about the officers who rushed into the school. Here are their pictures. One of them who took down the shooter, Rex Engelbert, there on the right side of your screen, grew up right here in Chicago. Our Ed Rod Cassidy. Cassidy spoke with his brother today. You got more on what he had to say about this. Yeah, he had a lot to say about his brother, in fact. Let's take a look at what he had to say, calling his brother a hero, as many people here in our community are as well. I think he's just... Uh, glad to uh, have some respite for the next couple of days. Kevin Engelbert describes how his brother, Officer Rex Engelbert, is doing today. Officer Engelbert, who grew up here in Chicago, is being called a hero for his actions in killing the shooter Monday at Covenant Christian School in Nashville. He just followed his training and um, is glad that his training and uh, kicked in and his fortitude withheld. The two spoke yesterday, and Officer Engelbert confirmed his role in stopping the threat at the school. He's being called a hero, but his brother explains that's just how they were raised. My ma uh, always taught us to be brave, and um, and you, I definitely am, was uh, almost not surprised to see that bravery come through in his actions. Uh, growing up with four boys, you and uh, and in Chicago, um, we uh, it, it's just uh, I, I've known Rex to always be. Uh, as, as brave as he is compassionate and, or, and a gentle giant. 27-year-old Officer Engelberg went to Queen of All Saints on Chicago's northwest side for grade school. He attended Loyola Academy for high school. Now, he's living in Nashville with his fiance. He's uh, incredibly passionate and um, about what he does, and he's always been a gentle giant, and um, he's always there for those in need. And just incredibly brave. Kevin told me that his brother, Officer Engelberg, he has taken some time off for the next few days or so. That is standard protocol. Now, coming up, I spoke with Rex's former football coach, who has known him and his family for years. You're going to hear his reaction to Officer Engelberg's heroism. That's coming up all new at 5. Wow. <laughs> Let me tell you something. That there is a hero cop. Now, funny bench warrant goes around and sit there says, oh, I hate the cops. I hate all oh, Oh, I hate the police. I hate the police. Oh, I got a grudge. No. I hate bad cops. I do news stories. I expose bad cops. Bad cops that get away and think they're above the law and like that. I love to do news stories about good cops. I'd rather do news stories about good cops all damn day than exposing bad cops. But this, this day and age, how many good cops out there in this society? Few and far. But this guy is a fucking absolute hero. Bam. Absolute hero, man. Officer of the year. Or it's not even April yet. The officer of the year. Anyways, I'm out of my job. Peace out.